Uh, yeah, show them the fit. You looking good? Thank yeah, do a 360. Let them see you. All right, for sure. Looking lovely. What you doing in my city? But he do. He, he represent every time. Fast, you know what I'm fast. saying? It's crazy. My brother, looks, yeah, he do it for the culture. I like this shit. We got her on how about the dog or that shot this one called in the most time. I like the culture, the vibe is different, the food is amazing, the people are way nicer. You cannot stop Mr. Rono, she got mad and it's the fun of I ain't tripping with your gun. You open it, it's real hot. The whole shit is hot. For sure. Um, and I like how it's just it's not slow. People think it's slow in Louisiana, but it's not. <laughs> Facts. Don't get in no relationship. That's why I play no games. Let's go. Ah. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. I gotta say, ain't nobody in the competition when it comes to danger. It's just okay. anywhere, anytime. You know? Yo, it's your boy Miko Worldwide, back with another hood vlog, man. Hey, we outside, man. Right now, we're coming live to from Baton Rouge. Hey, we with some real ones. They gonna tell you about where we at. I literally just got, I just drove here from Atlanta. I just been here like 30 minutes. I saw these guys recording. So, hey, man, they got some talent. So, let's talk to them, man. Hey, what's good, man? What's up, what's up, what's up? What's up? What's up? Who we here with? I'm a uh, I'm Lil Petty USA. You here with just me, my producer Kirk, right it's here, D Lo. I got my one of my VFX editors right here. Right he can introduce himself. Graphic so. designer too. Got my own clothing line. Up. Avalanche Studios. You know, got to hit us up. Yeah. What's yeah, up, man? I got man? my cameraman right here. He can introduce himself. You already himself. know. You already know. You know, Omar, bro. You can see me on uh, Instagram at that's Omar. I'm the cameraman. I be doing all the sick, uh, you know, little cinema. Little angles and shit, you know. That's what's Thanks, up, man. You can follow me on Instagram at K I R K D E L O A C H I G. That's Kirk the Lotus I G. Fuck with you. For sure. Yes, sir. All right, so shit, yeah, you just got a little insight to my little team that I keep around me, and they they one of the reasons why I am who I am today, sure. and why I'm able to put out the shit for y'all that I do today. Because without them. I just be just me sitting here trying to put out some fucking music, you know what I'm saying? Facts. So, it's always good to have a team. Out, you know, yeah. Little, you know, step by step. Yeah, man. Hey, man. Look, I'm super excited. Like, I'm back in Baton Rouge. The last vlog did over a million views. So, look, right now we're not exactly in a hood hood. We downtown, so um, it's exciting. But we haven't shown we haven't uh, shown this to the people yet. So, as we walk, just kind of tell us about like your music. How long you been an artist, stuff like that. All right. All right, so yeah. that last question was kind of like a funny one because I've been rapping since I say, I won't say I've been rapping since like second, third grade, bro. Like for sure, for sure. real shit, like writing down in the composition notebook front to back. So uh, I'll say I've been rapping for damn near fucking all my life. Like one day I just, I remember my uncle had like a little studio set up, him and his homeboys after high school. I was okay. probably like in fucking elementary school. They used to come home around the same time I used to get home. And them niggas would be in there, you know, like rapping and shit in my yeah. grandma's garage on their little studio set up and shit. So like me being young, that's what I see in front of me every day when I get home from school. And you know, all these niggas doing it, I want to do that shit, you know what I'm saying? It seemed Thanks. cool. So I've been really like working on that shit since all my life on some shit, bro. Like it's really what I want to do. But That's I start sure, taking man. that shit serious after I say not the ninth to tenth grade. I moved to Houston after eighth grade because my mama just wanted me, you know, from from round out this bitch. She didn't want me getting into shit. Other niggas around this bitch was getting into. So she she moved us to that bitch, and then. We went, I, I want to say we went by Pearland and then the sunny side when we first got to that bitch. So it was kind of like a reverse effect, you know what I'm saying? Like, okay, okay. It was basically the same shit out here, but with a bigger region to it. So it was really worse, but it was for the better at the same time, you know? But, facts, facts. Hey, when I um when I stopped y'all, y'all was doing a, a music video shoot, right? Yeah. That's what's up, man. What's the, what's the name of the track? That one is coming up from off of a project that we're still working on right now. I think me and Kirk will probably finish that bitch off tonight, huh? Yeah. 
probably gonna finish that bitch off tonight in the studio after we finish with this shit. That's what's but, up. Um, what studio? Um, do y'all have your own studio or y'all go to a studio? We both got our own studios. I mainly record at the crib. I might go to my manager shit, but okay. I'll go to his shit just to make beats mainly, and then go to my shit and lay the shit down. You know. Okay. But, okay. Um, what was it like, man? What was it like growing up out here, man? Because you know we always hear like this is real interesting, right? Here, <laughs> what's up, my brother? So what what was it what was it like growing up around here, man? Because you know we see the news, we see you know, but I want to hear from some natives, from people that's been out here, man. So so I ain't gonna lie, like you know, just like everywhere, like yeah. shit get real, but everybody got their certain extent, and the extent down here it get it, you know shit get real. It's but, no specific location. Yeah. Anyway, you right. it's anywhere, bro. Got gotcha, you. Can't gotcha, be like, gotcha. oh, my city is the most dangerous city. Yeah. Like, anyway, anytime, bro. Got you. Would you say that um, um, Baton Rouge is dangerous though? You can. I would say it's dangerous. I wouldn't say we the most dangerous city, but like yeah. I say, ain't nobody in competition when it comes to danger. It's just okay. anywhere, anytime. Got you. Got you. <laughs> got you. That's the culture. Now. <laughs> we got a lot of muscle cars. Yeah. As long as you stay in your lane, it's straight out here. Okay, okay. That's what's up, man. Don't cut nobody off, i tell you that. Louisiana, don't cut don't nobody, cut nobody <laughs> off. Don't cut nobody off. I remember when Hurricane Otto was going on. Nigga got shot just for waiting in line and gas and skipping that bitch. You know, you just got to have your manners down here. Niggas don't. Niggas like to get treated foul. Like yeah. a bitch down here. Facts, facts, facts. <laughs> There's a lot of pride problems down here. That's all it is. Just like everywhere else, but niggas got more pride problems down here than anywhere else a little bit. Okay, okay. So Mention it's more of like a respect thing. Like, people yeah, just want like, to be like niggas respected. really sp stand on their respect to the point where they don't realize they're not respecting another nigga that's standing on the same principles as them. So gotcha, the shit gotcha. just clashed. Okay, got you, got you, got you. All right. All right, we're going to show like a little bit of the downtown real quick. So these, so these type of places, do y'all like frequent like this stuff over here? Alright, not too much. Uh, actually, my people had a show at that venue right there. Uh, my manager, though, he had a show at that bitch, I'd say, like three, four months back. It was lit as a bitch. We fuck with it down here when they got something going on for the people like this. You know? Okay. Hey, man, we at the little corner store right here. Y'all see what time it is, man. Look, but they got a real life, real deal, like hot dog stand that looks like a hot dog. And then you open it, it's real hot. Dog. Woo, that shit is hot. Y'all see what's going on, man. Yeah, like, dope, man. You see what time it is, man. Look at this real quick. Uh, hey, Baton Rouge shit, man. We outside with it, man. Yo. Y'all see that, man. Slap it, man. Yes, sir. <laughs> yeah. Where we at right now, man? Downtown. Downtown type shit, yeah. yeah downtown type What's your name, bro? KK. KK? That's what's up, man. So I know we don't got no music, but you were saying you be doing what? Dancing and shit. That's what's up. I be digging and all that. that brother uh, here hold this for me real quick good shit man good shit that's what's up man where they find you bro what your name is at bzkk bzkk that's my instagram okay okay like b-e-z-z-y all right that was up man y'all see man baton rouge shit look look man it just is what it is man it's turnt bro yo <laughs> for sure i'm gonna get on here too man look hey 
he done ran into me. He was like, Miko Worldwide, what you doing in my city, man? Real talk. <laughs> He's like, real talk. They're like, what you doing in my city? Facts, man. man. They call me city. My name is city. What you doing in my city? But he do, he, he represent every time. Yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's crazy. My brother, lives, yeah, he do it for the culture. I like this shit. Exactly. Like this. Shout yourself out, man. Man, look, Side Soul City, everybody really from Bay Ridge know about me. That's you know what's what's up, man. Man. It be good and bad. Don't really give a fuck, though. Yeah, you know man. That, hey, the bag comes with it, bro. Look, you heard me. Look, good. I'm sliding on a bike tonight. So if you ain't thinking right, your brains can be left on the corner. <laughs> That's all. <laughs> all right, my buddy. Good to meet you. Yeah. Like that. A whole lot of that shit. Y'all see what time it is, man. Right, yeah. Yeah, we are. Right <laughs> I'm at the Silver and I ran out of gas and um I just got some gas so I'm gonna shoot to the house. <laughs> yeah, see what time it is, man. Downtown Bad Rouge, man, chilling, bye. Recording, recording. Yo, he said I wasn't supposed to be here. <laughs> The good thing, he ain't with no other women out here. He just, you know. <laughs> Yo. Okay. <laughs> Bro, trust me, man. So much shit be going down that you don't want to miss. Y'all see what's going on out here, man. Baton Rouge is real out here, man. They ain't even lighter. Give my keys. Hey. Give me my keys, man. Give me my keys. Look at that police. You want me to go to jail? Give me the police. Welcome to Baton Rouge, man. I don't think she knows that. Uh, We're gonna get them on here. Turning up for the vlog. Y'all see what's going on. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all see, man. Baton Rouge vibes. We outside with it, man. Yeah, that's it, man. Okay, the, right the right time, time man, for real. Hey, Jeez, gotta load it. What's up, lady? Yeah. <laughs> Crazy night, a lot of random shit. Y'all see the sparkles? Y'all see it, man? Yo, Baton Rouge lit tonight. Baton Rouge, facts, man. <laughs> shit, wow. Yo, what's good? Yeah, what yeah. was good, was good. You know it. Hey, they still, it was got good. Keys, you got your keys See, back? Trip. Hey, man. See, tripping. See, I got my keys back, man. Hey. Look, I'm going to tell you like them. this. You spared them. Don't get in no relationship. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, look, the bitch crazy. Hey, make sure you hit me on the gram, man. I'm hitting you on the gram. Miko Worldwide. All right, bro. <laughs> yo, yo. Bro, I guess you could really get with that now. Hey, yeah. But hey. really, look, they finna go home. He finna tear it up. I'm telling you, like, you can just tell, bro. Like, she. Damn, hey, man. Yeah, real. No, yeah, just facts. ten minutes ago, she told. She. <laughs> just ten minutes ago. Ladies, what's good? Hello. All right, all right. Beautiful. Ago, he told her on the phone. He was at Chevron. <laughs> Facts. Bro, <laughs> she pulled, she him pulled right there. She, yo, she located this nigga. Like, right. oh yeah, you at Chevron. I right, bet. <laughs> bet. I'm you gonna I'm, sneak yeah, that boy. Yeah, yeah. Choke that yeah. boy. Son, but, slung his ass down. He son, was on the ground for like right. five minutes. My partner got out of my place. He's like, let me give it up. I have a beat. Make it pop, you'll see that. I put it in big ass. That fucking piece of the jig is up. My pump with the pass on the semi truck. We all got heads, he can see me turn. That way, no head. The fuck it up. Walk down with the clock, I'ma bust it up. She bad as a bitch, I'ma bust it up. Walk down with a friend, like, what's up? Yo, this cute bitch, she need a touch up. She's in the play. Mugga like mustard, bitch, in the dirt. I'm trying to get a brother. Don't catch hot ups, but I ain't hungry. You can not stop. Mr. Run up, she got mad and it's the fun up. I ain't tripping. Put your gun up, you could spin around this bitch with your smoke. Put your lunch up, I'm gonna get you back in, bitch. Cause she's thick up, but her butt and white beat. Exactly rich, you ain't really run your funds up. If they organize a hit, they gon' have to come and bum us. Cause we walking around with sticks, they lock you up for the summer. I like the slide with five, I say when you be aiming, it's just fun. I like to spit up on her shit before I hit it like a plum. I heard a nigga taking work, ain't too long time. I call that number, took the nose and got no guap. Oh shit, we gotta run, hop out the door, or that chop. This why I call the number one stop. My shooter's banking on me now, cause I'm no longer the gunner.
Y'all see what's going on, man. Yeah. Hey, music video shoot, man. Hey, let them know where to find you, big dog. I be at L I L P A T E K U S A. That's me. All right. All right. So, guys, right now we here with Miss Tia. Beautiful Miss Tia. All right. So you were telling me kind of behind the camera, like we you moved here from Atlanta. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. So what's what has it been like? How do you like um, here compared to Atlanta? I know you spent some time in Houston too. So what's been the vibe here? How you like it? I like the culture. The vibe is different. The food is amazing. The people are way nicer. For um, sure. And I like how it's just, it's not slow. People think it's slow in Louisiana, but it's not. <laughs> Facts. Pretty dope. They got cool people. Amazing community. So I like the vibe here. That's what's up. So top three between here, Houston, and Atlanta. Which one would you place first? Which one would you place last? Houston. Louisiana, Atlanta. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Look, hey. I appreciate you. Uh -huh. I just met my wife now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, appreciate you, the hop. Yes. See you, Tia. Look, I promise you, I'm the most dopest guitarist you'll ever know. So follow me on Instagram. Yeah, yeah he is. He is dope. I'm, I'm cocky about it. I'm For sure. He said, I'm cocky I'm about cocky. it. <laughs> and I dress cool and shit, so it just goes with it. It goes with it. <laughs> so you gonna have some fun tonight? You gonna? You gonna yeah. turn up? Yeah, show them the fit. You looking good? Thank yeah, do a 360. Let them see you. All right, for sure. Looking lovely. All right. All right. Nice to meet you, nice beautiful. Nice to meet you. I can't wait to see that video. For sure. For sure. Yo, be careful. All right, you as well. This one. Hey man, we outside with it. We inside the store, man. Look, it's lunch shit, man. Yo, you see what's out there, man? <laughs> <laughs> hey man. Yo, where we at, man? Get on the way. Where we at, man? Get on the way. Not just like with you. Yo, man. What's good, famo? Corner store. Corner store shit, man. I'm What's up? What's up? Hey, yo. Third for trying to get a brother. Yo. You cannot stop Mr. Run up. She got mad and it's the fun I ain't tripping. But you're gonna be a spinner around this bitch with your smoke. Making beach, she she's the go put her bun up. Why these niggas acting rich? You ain't really run your fuck up. If they organize a hit, they gon' have to come up. Oh shit, we gotta run. How about that door with that chop? That's why I call my number one gun. My shooters banking on me now, cause I'm all over the gun. Yo, yo, <laughs> y'all see, that's how we doing it, man. Hey, man, corner store shit, we outside with it, man. Hey, big dog, appreciate you, big dog. What they call you, bro? Alex. Yeah, man. Alex, Alex what's good, man? What's good, man? Miko, good, right, good right, to meet you, man. Yup, I'm already know who you is, <laughs> He said, I'm already know who you is. <laughs> hey, man, we here, man. Yeah. Bro, he seen the which hey, one was it? The uh, the one I think you was in Bama. You had you was up in the yellow Corvette. Yeah, the man. Kept double backing up in that white truck. You was like, hold on, let me get my shit. My truck. <laughs> <laughs> like, what? Like, okay, I'm ready. <laughs> if they know, they know. Yeah, yeah they was, man. Appreciate y'all, man. Yeah, yeah. All right. Yeah. Outside with it, man. Yo. Hey, y'all see we're on third in Florida, man. Hey, folks, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> hold on, man. How y'all doing? Hey, man, this is what we do. Yeah, y'all looking good, though. What's up, man? Y'all see what's going on out here, man. Real block life shit, man. Yo. 
Welcome to Baton Rouge, man. Y'all see what time it is, man. What's up, y'all? Y'all just tuned in with a paddock and caught a little glimpse of downtown streets of BR. You know what I'm saying? Y'all was able to catch me while I was in the middle of shooting a little music video for the project coming out D Day. Shout out Kurt. I mean, Kurt, he finna be the main producer on the project for damn near every song. Yes, I'll say probably like 50, 60% of the tape. That's all Kurt. So make sure you be listening for his sounds. Y'all just tapped in with me, finished watching the video, see what Nico got going on, see what I got going on.